Coming to you from our GIS studios, I am Janel Novel and this is your Midday News Brief. Sufra Comprehensive Secondary School retains a St. Lucia Hotel and Tourism Association Chefs in Schools Championship title for yet another year. The SLHTA would like to congratulate the Sufra Comprehensive Secondary School on winning the Chefs in Schools Cook-Off 2019. The winning team consists of performers Shaquin Frankie and Kayla Joseph and was trained and coached by Chef Ruben Kumar of Anne Chastney Resort over the past two months in preparation for the competition. The team put on a great show in both the signature dish and mystery basket rounds at the recently held competition on their home grounds at the Sufra Comprehensive Secondary School on Thursday 13th and Friday 14th June 2019. In second place was the St. Joseph's Convent team consisting of Janai Williams and Chris Joseph, trained by Chef Nisa Paul of Windjama Landing Villa Beach Resort. In third place was Makai J. Jean and Wavemi Prosper of the Leon Hair Secondary School and trained by Chef Billy Morissette of Cap Maison. Kayla and Shaquin, along with their chef and teacher, will travel to Barbados to represent St. Lucia at the Regional Caribbean Junior Dueling Challenge come August this year. Their training will continue over the summer in preparation for the regional leg of the culinary competition. The competition was proudly sponsored by the Tourism Enhancement Fund, Winfresh Limited and Trans-Caribbean. Special thanks goes out to the schools and students who participated in this year's event. The Leon Hairs Comprehensive, John Odlum, Barbano, Chozel, St. Joseph's Convent, Entripo, Sufra Comprehensive, Angers, Castries Comprehensive and the Saira Seaman Secondary School. The final of the Tika Caribbean Entrepreneurship Challenge concluded in Martinique with a young St. Lucian claiming the top spot. President Alfred Marie-Jean awarded 19-year-old Sophie Klein with the winning prize, a Euro $10,000 grant to develop her project Joa, which aims to transform the world of education by integrating virtual reality. The Tika Caribbean Entrepreneurship Challenge is organized by the Chamber of Commerce and Industry of Martinique in partnership with the Territorial Collectivity of Martinique, the Organization of Eastern Caribbean States, OECS, and the Caribbean Export Development Agency. The Caribbean Entrepreneurship Challenge aims to sensitize the youth on cooperation in the Caribbean, encourage young entrepreneurs to mobilize their skills to serve their country, and to promote entrepreneurial innovation. Back in St. Lucia District 1, Education Office has signed up with Joa's Virtual Reality Program. Joa Innovative Learning Solutions, Inc. is directly affiliated with JUMP, Juniors Under Mentorship Program. Joa focus on the academics and are driven by virtual reality, where students are able to experience the joy of learning through gaming technology and alternative learner-centered teaching methods while being fully immersed in academic environments specific to each subject area. Minister for Equity, Social Justice, Local Government and Empowerment Honorable Leonard Montout is following through with his promise to lend more assistance in creating increased opportunities and providing greater support for local artists, musicians and producers. Minister Montout explained that a contract has been signed under the Basic Needs Trust Fund for the establishment of a music recording studio in the town of Grosile. Upon completion, musicians will have access to state-of-the-art recording equipment and technical support to help improve the quality of their craft, whilst benefiting from assistance that will help take their creations well beyond the St. Lucian borders. That's all for our Midday News Brief. Thanks for tuning in.